Today we are on a property near Gloucester with the Barrington River running alongside it. It's been a property that has, a pro has had a project done on it through our, with funding through our Marine Estate Management Strategy Program funded by DPI Fisheries. Uh, today we're going to be talking to Matt, the landholder who has been very busy in the past year doing this project. <laughs> Hi Matt. Thanks Kirby, how are you? Good thanks. Um, would you be able to tell me a bit about your project? What did you end up doing? So I think probably one of the big features of the project was getting the water off the river um, and into troughs along the along the front paddocks here. Yep. A um, couple of solar panels, small little pump in the river, into a tank, and then gravity fed out of the tank. And that, that initially stopped the cows going down into the river. Yep. And, and making a mess and then we were able to fence along the river as well. Yeah, so you did a lot of fencing in this project as well. We did, what, yeah. So. Whereabouts did you fence on your property? So we've got three kilometres of Barrington River frontage and we fenced a kilometre and a half of that. And so part of the project also included doing weed control along there? Yeah, so the weed control is was probably a, a, a lot harder than I, than I expected yep. and not so much in the just going through the first run and, and mechanically removing everything, but the, everything comes back again. Yeah. So it's just going over and, and keeping, keeping keeping an eye on it and keeping it under control. So you fix one problem and you end up with, yep. with um, other things happening that you need to uh, just keep keep an eye on. Yep. You've had a few problems in the past year doing the project out of your control. Yeah. So, um, <laughs> <laughs> so what what was one of the issues along the river? with your tree planting that you had? Yeah, so we in initially did some tree planting and then uh, had a, a big rush of water come through, yep. uh, a bit of a flood and washed out some of those young seedlings. A lot of them did survive yep. and they've come back yep. bigger and stronger than ever. So it's it's actually worked out. Yep. And so what about um, in another section of the project, it included fencing out and eroding gully on your property. What made you choose this specific gully and what did you do? Well this specific gully we chose chose this gully because when it does rain it, it acts like a funnel. Every time it rained it seemed to take off another few centimetres of soil yeah. so we we're quite keen to fence that off and I think all up it's about a two hectare gully area that we've fenced out and replanted with native veg as well. Yeah um, so this project's completed uh, what's future. are you motivated for the future? Have you got future plans? Yeah, it's been it's been actually quite inspiring. It was a little bit daunting, um, sort of midway through the project, um, middle of the drought. There are a lot of things going on, but having got to the end of it uh, and seen the benefits that we've we've achieved just on this section of the river, yeah, we'll look to push that to the other the other kilometre and a half of river frontage that we've got. And environmentally, it's a big step being able to keep stock out of, of your waterways mm. um, because, you know, everything that happens on the bank is going to be getting downstream. So I think the community would probably really appreciate yes. that you've got less, <laughs> less stock in the water. And um, we've got the uh, Manning River turtle that, you know, caused, um, caused the Manning river it's home so mm. it's endangered and, a, and an endemic species so yeah. it's pretty exciting that we've got you as a landholder wanting to protect the yeah. catchment. There are a few platypuses down along yeah. there as well so it's it's a fantastic stretch of it's stretch beautiful. of river <clears throat> and a lot of kayakers come up and down here as well so um, I guess being able to to have that Demonstrating Beautified. good land yeah, management. Exactly. So, um, <laughs> yep. yeah, it, it makes a huge difference, I think, not just to us, but other people or other users of the river. That's excellent. Fantastic. Thanks for talking to me yeah, today. Thanks, Kirby.